Hi everyone, um, it's me Sarah and today we are doing a heavily requested five minute um, little burst of energy flow. You can do this in the morning if you need a little pick me up. You can also do this before a workout or a run just to get yourself going. So let's start in child's pose. Bring the big toes to touch knees wide, sink the hips back and reach the arms forward. Begin to energize your breath, breathing into the ribs and breathing out into the hips. One more conscious inhale in. And exhale out. Good. Start to rise up into tabletop, stacking the shoulders over wrist and hips over knees. Inhale to drop the belly, lift the gaze. Exhale, curl. Inhale, arching, lift the gaze. And exhale, curl. Good. As you arch, Feel your hands pulling your heart through. And as you curl, feel the belly drawing up and in. One more. Good. Come to neutral spine. Left hand's going to come in the middle of the chest. Inhale. Let's pull back on the right arm. Reach it up to the sky. Exhale, thread it through, come onto the right shoulder, right side of the head, and maybe reach the left arm towards the front of the mat. Thread the needle. Careful your hips didn't shift to the left. Bring them back to center so this is coming from the upper back, this twist. One more breath. Should feel really good. And then plant that left hand back down. Inhale, lift the right arm back up. Beautiful. Exhale, release. Inhale, left arm reaches. Exhale, it threads through. Maybe you reach the right arm towards the top of the mat. This should feel really good if you're doing this in the morning. I know my shoulders get tight because I'm a side sleeper, so we're all pretty tight in our shoulders in the morning. Good. Plant the right hand back down. Inhale, lift the left arm up. Beautiful. Release it. Bring your hands out about another handprint distance forward. Tuck the toes. We lift the hips high. Downward facing dog. Take any movement that feels good. Inhale, come high on the toes. And exhale, relax the heels down. Two more like that. Inhale, high on the toes. Exhale, heels drop down. Good. One more. Inhale, high on the toes. Exhale, heels drop down. This time, inhale forward to plank. One long line. Exhale here. <sighs> Hugging that core in. One more inhale. And exhale. Good. Side plank. Roll onto the outer edge of the left foot. Come onto the inner arch of the right foot. Right arm reaches up option to circle that right wrist one way and then the other way and come back to regular plank inhale side plank other way left arm reaches up and taking those wrist circles if you'd like one way the other way notice if you lost your breath just Taking one more final inhale. Exhale. Back to plank. Good. Inhale. Shift your weight a little bit forward on the toes. And exhale. Lower to the belly. Untuck the toes. Let's actually bring our hands, um, spider fingers, out wide today so we can roll the shoulders back. So we inhale, little baby cobra. And exhale. Release. Good. Keep the toes planted down. The tailbone reaching back to the toes. Just upper back lifts. Inhale. Exhale. Last one. You might lift a little higher. 
Inhale, energy up and forward. Exhale, releasing. Bring the hands back under the shoulders. Tuck the toes, lift the knees. We're going to try to come back straight into plank. So pushing up, plank pose. It might have been more of a worm than straight up. It's okay. Exhale, downward facing dog. Good. See if you can, this time in downward facing dog, find a little stillness. Three breaths. Good. Inhale, looking forward to the hands. And exhale, stepping up, forward fold. Let's take a ragdoll fold. So nice, easy bend in the knees and take any sway side to side movements that feel good. Maybe shaking the head yes and no. <sighs> nice inhale here. Exhale, drop the tailbone down. We'll roll up nice and slow to stand. Good. Imagine you're just receiving energy through your palms, through your whole front side of your body. And when you're ready, bring the hands to heart center. And we bow the head. Namaste.